So let's continue working and in this video we're gonna add the Dara Magellan plugin in this project and we're gonna add the Dara Magellan here on the on order list you add Dara Magellan so that's everything that we need in this sidebar that HTML let's open the main content and I'm gonna scroll to the top here on the div id chapter 01 and the, the class chapter we're gonna add data magellan target and the target is gonna be this one right here so we have equals and in south quotes we have chapter 01 so we have something like this you don't have to add the the pound sign with this is enough so I'm gonna copy this I'm gonna scroll paste right here and I'm gonna change 0, 01 to 0, 02 continue paste and let's add, change this to 0, 03 paste and this will be 0, 04 and paste it will be 0, 05 and finally let's change this to 0, 06 so let's save this and open Chrome again and I'm gonna right click and inspect the element so let's inspect right here one of these links and I'm gonna expand all of them and I'm gonna start scrolling you can see that here on the 01 we have this class active we have this data events scroll so let's continue and once we reach the chapter 02, we can see that we remove the, the active class and now it's on the chapter 02. So now this is working. I'm going to open the assets, CSS, and let's open this app, CSS. Here at the bottom, I'm going to add some CSS. And normally, we add the uh, custom style sheet but we're only, we're only adding four lines of code so i don't think that we need to add something like that let's add a menu class li anchor active because the active class is being added to the anchor and let's add a background color the background color is going to be the primary color and the color is going to be white so let's save this and now you can start scrolling and you can see that we highlight in the current the current section we have something like this so this is looking really cool i think and you can add example a transition maybe transition all the three sex is and you can see we have this small transition between each element So that's something really cool that can be done with foundation and you can see this is the example and it's not the same well maybe yes it's the same but we have this transition and you can see that we didn't have to add a lot of different well a bunch of html and we have a really cool example so this is the second example of the foundation projects if you have more ideas send a message and we're gonna create some videos with your example